All right, I'm going to go over uh, exit tickets for lessons uh, one, two, three, four, and five. Okay, this is your homework for tonight. Um, lesson one, okay, so we're going back a little bit. Um, remember, we still need to keep track of, you know, right angles equal 90 degrees, angles in a straight line equal 180, um, angles in a circle add up to be 360. So we'll need, need to keep those things in mind as we go over this. So I already have the work done. Haley Burns, the main office. Haley Burns, the main office. So, Jonathan Green, please report to your boss. Jonathan Green, please report to your boss. So I'll just kind of like explain through how I got, how I got the, the answer here. So number one says, students set up and solve an equation to solve for the value of x. Use the value of x and a relevant angle relationship in the diagram to determine the measure of angle EAF. Okay? EAF is boom, boom, boom. Okay? So you need to, uh, we need to be able to tell what this angle measure is. Okay? So what we can say is that if we add GAC, which is this angle, plus angle CAF, which is this angle, okay, those two angles together we see is a 90 degree angle, right? So if we kind of turn it this way, we're talking about this angle. This angle right there is made up of these two angles, okay? So if I take my X, and my 63, x plus 63, set it equal to 90 because it's a right angle. Subtract 63 from both sides, I end up with x equals 27. So this angle right here is 27. Students, please report to your buses at this time. Then I can say angle EAF and angle FAC, okay, EAF, this one, and angle EAC also equal 90 degrees because if I flip this upside down here, okay, this is a straight line here. That'd be 180 degrees, all the angles. So this angle plus this angle plus this angle equals 180 degrees. Well, I know that this angle right here is 90 degrees, therefore this angle must be 90 degrees. So my 63 plus my unknown here Okay, is going to get our 63 plus my 90 plus my unknown here is going to equal 180. Okay, um, if I take out this 90, I know this is a right angle, so just 63 plus this unknown will give me 90 as well. So that's what I have here. My unknown is angle EAF. I'm adding that to 63, and since I know that these two angles here are, add up to 90. And since I know these two angles here add up to 90, uh, I can just set it equal to 90. Okay. Grade 7 and 8, report to your buses. Grade 7 and 8, report to your buses. So, since, so then we find out that angle EAF equals 27 as well. So since EAF and GAC are both complements of 63, 